in our Chevrolet. Turn right Hi, and welcome back to Run Away From Home. Today, we're doing a different type of YouTube. We've got a lot of questions on what it looks like to actually pack up and hit the road. So we're gonna do this vlog to show you what a high travel day actually looks like. The first step is I took a shower. You usually always try and shower right before we leave for um, our next stop, especially if it's gonna be farther away. Today, we're going from Colorado to New Mexico. The total drive time for a regular car is about eight and a half hours. Step one after showering is always to make the bed so that we can actually put stuff away. Because when we're actually driving, we have a lot more stuff inside the RV than we do when we're actually at our destination. All right, so let's put the bed together. Next step is we take everything from the cab and put it down here. So you can see the dinette, everything is kind of starting to be more filled out and more full. It makes it so that our RV isn't very usable when we're traveling, except for to drive and for the dogs. snacks to the road and hydrating snacks. We got watermelon and kale. They're cooling, healthy, delicious. So this is an unfortunate reality but our fridge went out when we weren't in the RV because we were actually at my brother's for a while and now all our food has gone bad. Even the freezer is cold. That never happens. Yeah, straight water. Ready to go? Finally. This is what it looks like when it's all full. We fill our dinette all up. Obviously the stand is for me to record. And then here we go. We do have to keep our spare tire in the back. And then we keep anything that might shift in the sink. And here's a dog's bed. Now, even though it looks really cluttered right now, the truth is for the most part, we can have a little way to walk through and most of this stuff leaves the RV the second we get to a spot. All right, so we're on the way to get ice. What else? Oh, oil filter or funnel, an oil funnel, because we are gonna top off our rig with oil since we're doing a long drive. And that's it, right? That's all we need? Maybe some caffeine. <laughs> Thank you. 
We use Gas Buddy to save on gas everywhere we go, and here you can see we got 30 cents off a gallon. Ditto! No! Oh man! You got it! <laughs> He's eating our bread! Drop it! <laughs> Hello! Hello. Okay. All right, let's add some ice. So we made it to our spot for the night. We're actually staying at a truck stop because on longer routes when we're trying to get to a very specific place, we choose somewhere really easy right off the freeway. So we're at Ru Russell's truck stop in New Mexico. We just made it through the New Mexico border. So we successfully made it out of Colorado. The smoke is already a lot better here, which is great. Yeah, this is the usually the part where we're exhausted, looking for easy something, and we're ready to here comes a truck in. We're ready to rest for the night. It's actually really beautiful here. It's awesome. I'm a future.